Hello, Space Cadets! I am Sergeant Space Panda, and welcome to Stardew Valley, a cute little RPG game that seems to be running around the internet, and I thought, why not give it a try? So, let's get in. Okay, well, first off, we want to be a girl. Okay, she looks, she looks nice enough. Now, for the name... Well, my channel name is Panda, so let's go with that. For the farm name... We should live on the space farm. And my favorite thing? Uh, probably gonna say YouTube. Okay. Animal preference, cats, dogs. I like cats. Um, you know, all of this is hunky-dory. I don't really care. Let's get right in. I've heard a lot of good things about this game and I decided to play it for myself. That is a magnificent sword. And for my very special granddaughter. Oh, Grandpa. I want you to have this sealed envelope. Oh, really? For me, an envelope? You shouldn't have. Oh, thank you. No, no. Don't open it yet. Have patience. So you want me to, like, wait for you to die? Now listen close. Okay, I'm listening. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. That's not morbid at all, Grandpa. <laughs> Ooh. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. What the hell, Grandpa? What kind of speech is this? This is not a speech you give somebody on your deathbed. This is just sad and morbid. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Okay, well, still. That's still freaking sad. Why? What's with the pillow lump? Do you spoon it? Now let Grandpa rest. XX years later. Okay. Joja, join us. Thrive. Work. Okay. Bunch of little cubicles. Okay. This is creepy. Smile. You're with Joja. Terminated. Oh, I like your hat. Life's better with Joja. This this is really creepy. Why am I here? Why? Why am I here? I look so sad. Oh no. Oh, can I can I look around? I suppose I can. Oh! Oh the letter! I should probably take that, huh? Dear Panda, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. That creepy little bed you died in? I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Space Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Oh, that was nice. I like farms. I actually live on a farm. Well, I don't really live on the farm. I live next to one, but I've got, like, livestock and stuff. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Was Lewis your lover, Grandpa? Don't lie. Don't lie. Was Lewis your lover? So, it looks like we're going to live on a farm, guys. That's exciting. Oh, look, it's so pretty. It's so green. I miss the green. It's like March, and it's not really green yet, but it's not really dead, so it's kind of in between, and it's just not fun. Like, in the mornings, it's super cold, and in the afternoons, it's super hot, and I'm looking forward to this green. There's just green everywhere. Where I live, there's a lot of green, and all the trees come to life. Stardew Valley, 0.5 miles. And it's just, it's really nice out. Like, the berry blossoms, or the some kind of blossoms. I'm not sure exactly what kind. Hello, little bird. They just come to life and it's so pretty. Oh. Hello, you must be Panda. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Hello, Robin. You're very nice looking. The farm's right over here, if you'll follow me. Okay. Looks like we're just gonna follow her. Oh. Oh! Oh, it's cute! It's a little cabin! That's nice. I like little cabins. 
excuse me while I adjust my chair here. Don't mind me. This is Space Farm. Oh, yeah, I know, there's a lot of brush. We're gonna be here a while. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's still some good soil underneath that mess. It's a lot of mess though, like, damn, Grandpa, you just let the place go, didn't you? With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. I mean, 10 years worth of rot, I guess, but... Jeez, why are the rocks jumping? Do you guys see that? The little jumping rocks? And here we are, your new home. You look way more excited than I feel right now. Let's be real. Do I like... Oh, hello! Why were you in my house? That's, that's a little weird. Ah, oh, the new farmer. Okay, hi. Nice to meet you. Could you stay out of my house, please? Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. Grandpa said to say hi to you, but you were just creepily wandering around in my house, so I think I'm gonna just, you know, obey the stranger danger laws and just not talk to you ever again. You know, everyone's been asking about you. Have they? That's creepy. Maybe I should have moved. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. That's still really creepy. Please stop. Just go home. I don't want any of your free candy. Don't give me your candy. I don't want it. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. Yeah, the one you were just prowling around in, you weirdo. It's a good house. Very rustic. I don't, I don't like those quotes around rustic. I do not like them, Sam I am. I would not like them with green eggs and ham. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Ooh, I forgot to turn on my timer. Hang on, guys. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Ugh. My house is rude. My house is crusty. That's, that's nasty. That's gross, guys. That's, no, I don't want to live here. Don't listen to her, Panda. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Humph. Well, I mean, is it true? Are you trying to get me to buy your house upgrades? Because that's, that's a cheap shot. That's cheap, insulting my house so I make it better to please you. That is cheap. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. I mean, it's like two in the afternoon. I could just have a cup of coffee and keep going with my day, but whatever, I'll take a nap. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. That's freaking creepy. Just go ra randomly walk up to the street and be like, Hi, how are you? How you doing? How you from? And the little, can't talk. That's even weirder. Just be like, hi. So, I'm new here and like, we should be friends. That's, that's, that's just creepy. That's weird. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. That's creepy. You're gonna come to my house in the middle of the night and take stuff from a wooden box? That's weird. Well, good luck. Thanks. Please never come back, you creepy little stalker. Goodbye. So long. Farewell. Bye-bye. <laughs> Morning already? I didn't even go inside. Holy crap, that was fast. So, yeah. Um, hi, guys. How's it going? How have your days been? Thanks for, you know, watching the video. I really appreciate it. It really helps. And... My progress has been saved. That's comforting. Okay, so guess we should hop on out of bed. Ooh. Let's go check this lovely box here. Oh, we got some parsnip seeds and a new journal entry. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. So you came into my house while I was sleeping to give me presents. You're not Santa. It's not December and that's creepy. Okay, getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed pack on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Okay. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Two out of 28 people? That's a lot of people. Okay, well, might as well get started. I've got an ax, a hoe, you dirty hoe. A watering can, a pickaxe, and a scythe, and some parsnip seeds. Have you guys, are parsnips really a thing? I think, I'm pretty sure they are, but like, have you guys ever had them? I feel like they're disgusting. Just, just a thought. If I'm wrong, someone please correct me. Yeah. Oh, that was creepy. That was awesome though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh God. What was that? Yeah. 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 
I'm so good at this. Check me out. I'm just gonna, just gonna, you know. Wah! I could like, I could beat somebody up with this. Just don't, don't come near me. I've got an axe. Oh, okay. Just yeah. You could like beat somebody with this. I'm gonna be the scariest farmer on the block. Just wah! Maybe I can like, are you monsters? Can I? No, you're just gonna sit there and creepily dance on my yard. That's not weird. Yeah. Oh, I missed. Yeah. Yeah. Chop the tree. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. This this is this is taking a long time. So how have you guys been? How's your day going? Oh. 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 Look at all this stuff. Oh, so much stuff. Oh God. Pokemon has taught me to never go in the tall grass. Dude, this place sucks. Why did I come here? Why? I should have just settled for my meaningless existence in life. Oh, see, look, what the heck is it? It's like little and green and nasty. Ooh, we found something. What's this? Can I, can I? No, I can't. Okay, I didn't want to click you anyway. Wah, chop the stump. Wah, wah. Oh my gosh, so much chopping. On the bright side, I'm getting some wood. Haha, <laughs> got wood? Yeah, I do. I'm sorry, that was uncalled for. Okay, well, um, we've cleared off a nice, die tree, die, kill the environment. We've cleared out a nice little bit of space here. We should probably, you know, get to work on that whole farming thing, so let's, Hoe some soil with our dirty, dirty hoe. I know some dirty, dirty hoes. Huh. Let's call it Henrietta Hoe. That, that sounds like a lovely name. Okay. Looks like enough space. Now we're just gonna boop, 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 boop. Oops, oops. Well, on the bright side, found a shortcut. Boop, boop. 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 Bop. Boop. Boop. Okay. Now, I guess we just... Why do they wiggle when you water them? That's, that's creepy. Don't wiggle. Don't do that. That's suggestive. Stop. Okay, now that that's done, um... Should we clear some more land? Let's just clear all of this tall grass, because I feel like there's going to be wild Pokemon in it, and I do not want any of that nonsense. Okay, let's, oh, we seem to have quite a bit of land, and there seems to be quite a bit of crap in our way. That's lovely. I guess I'll just spend the rest of my life clearing out this land. Didn't like, wasn't like I had anything better to do with my time. Okay, um, just gonna keep on clearing. Oh, Kidoki, there's a lot of crap in my way, is there? Well, I mean, it's not like I had anything to do with my life. I wanted to farm, but nah, it's cool. I'll just, you know, I'll just do manual labor. Rude. My axe is plenty strong. My axe is beautiful. Don't you dare tell my axe what it can and can't do with its life. How dare you, good sir? I am offended. I like that sound effect. The little, like, rock sound effect. That's pretty neat. Let's go crush a bunch of rocks because I really like the sound effects. Okay. On the bright side, it's a very cute little game. Like, it's very adorable. I really like the graphics and the music, if you guys can hear it, I hope you guys can. It's really nice, it's very calming and peaceful, which is nice, because I feel like we're gonna need that on the channel, because, you know, Buried, I have a feeling it's gonna get real creepy real quickly. What do you guys think is going to happen with that, by the way? I'm thinking, like, aliens, maybe, or, like, I don't know. Maybe zombies? Maybe I just, maybe I just like zombies too much. That could be a thing. Okay, well, we've got a bunch of rocks now. That's lovely. I like rocks. They're my only friends. <laughs> uh, I don't have friends. Like, I really, I don't have friends. Wah! Hi! I'm a master rock cutter. I was in prison for 12 years for shanking a man. I, I learned how to cut the best rocks and eventually escaped to freedom by whittling a bunch of rocks into, I don't know, some kind of weapon. I didn't think this through before I started talking. I apologize. She 
kind of looks like she'd be in prison though, huh? What? Is this a tree? Oh, I guess so. Well, this is a lot of crap to clear away. Do you guys like when games do this when they give you like 30 billion years worth of like manual useless labor? I don't really think, I'm not really a fan of it personally. I don't like having to do all of this because it seems like it's totally there to be a time waster. And I mean, it does, it does give me a chance to talk to you guys, which is nice because, you know, I like talking to you. I like being able to connect with you guys. Maybe I should tell you some stories. Let's see. Um, well, like I said, I do live in a very rural kind of area where this happens a lot. There's lots of farms and there's lots of livestock and there's lots of manual labor. So this is kind of like home. It's kind of nice, kind of familiar. Cut the tree, cut it, cut it. Yes, cut that tree. Yeah. Oh my gosh, so much cutting. I'm like clicking super excessively right now. Why? Why do you make me cut all of this stuff down? This seems like a waste of my time, honestly. No, I have to like, oh, I have to stand in front of something to cut it? That's stupid. Okay. Okay, I've got lots of wood. <laughs> got the wood. Uh, that joke's never gonna get old. I'm gonna constantly make that joke. Just so you guys know. Okay, I'm not sure what we're gonna do with all this wood yet. I mean, what do you normally do with wood? I'm sorry, I'm terrible. Oh, I seem to be tired. I don't know how to fix that. Okay, I'm sorry. Can I put stuff in my box? Let's see. Let's boop in the box. Boop in the box. Boop. No, let's keep my wood. Boop. What's this? Oh, coal. That's nice. Okay, let's just continue on our merry way. Let's go exploring. I mean, it's only 4.30, it's, it's early in the afternoon. What's this sign say? Can I, can I, can I read the, can I, can I, can I, can I read the, can I, oh, excuse me, I was pushing the wrong button. Bus stop in Pelican Town. Let's, let's go wander around Pelican Town for a while. Oh, look at my cute little run cycle. I'm so cute. I think I can actually run. Oh, I push shift to walk. That's weird. Okay, okay. Oh, hey dude. Sup, brah? Can I? Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. You look like that guy from that 80s movie about the dirt bike people. I don't know what the movie was called, but like, they went dirt biking a lot, and they won like this contest, and he was like, haha, yeah. That's what you remind me of. Or maybe Goku. Or, not Goku. I'm gonna get a lot of hate for that one, but like the blonde guy in the Dragon Ball Z series? I don't know. Let's, oh. Okay, can I talk to you? Oh, it's Leah. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Oh, I thought you were the girl from earlier. Cause you're, now that I think about it, her name was Robin. Sorry, that's awkward. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna continue on our merry way here. Oh, hello. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along great. I'm Alex. You look like a self-centered, overconfident twat, but I could be wrong. Oh, it's a dog. Can I like, can I, can I, can I, no, I can't. Okay, what's this? I can't have that either. Can I have anything? Like what the, why can't I? I guess I can't have anything. Okay. Might as well go on our merry little way. Ooh, people, hi people. I love people. Let's talk. Why, why aren't you? None of my controls are working right now, guys. Okay, that didn't want to work. That's lovely. Might as well just... Am I getting tired from doing this? I hope not. That would be a bummer. Okay, let's try to talk to somebody. Maybe I couldn't talk to them because they were sitting. Now that I think about it, let's try talking to this dude again. I'll see you around. Oh, yeah, okay. So I guess I just couldn't talk to him because they were sitting. That's a thing, I guess. Oh, picnic table. Ooh, a bridge. The bridge to Terabithia. Ooh, what's this? Closed until summer. Oh, okay. That's lovely. Can I... Oh. The music just cut out. That was creepy. Can I... Oh, I'm exhausted. That's a shame. The music just, like 
cut out. That was creepy. Oh, hello, big fat person. Let's talk, you and I. You're a little pudgy, aren't you? Let's talk to me. Come back. Come back. Come back. I'm so lonely. Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Er, hi. I'm Clint. That's a nice beard you got there, bro. Is that all you're going to say? I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. That's nice. It got kind of dark, didn't it? It got a little bit dark. It's like seven, it's like eight o'clock at night. Ooh, here's a saloon. Let's go to the saloon. Cause you know, I'm not underage. Welcome. Oh, thank you. Can I like, can I order something? Can I like, can I, can I buy, can I have something? Can I have something? Oh, oh, I can. Okay. We can have a beer or some salad or some bread or spaghetti or, oh, there's a lot of options. Oh, I can have recipes. That's pretty cool. These are all really expensive and I'm really poor. Let's have some bread. Why not? Why not? Let's just, let's buy some bread. Can I, oh, why, can I eat it? Oh, yes I can. Oh, thank you. Oh, my energy went up. That's nice. Who are you? Hey kid, the name's Pam. You look like a creepy soccer mom, Pam. Can I, oh, I can just help myself. Let's just go right back here. Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Stardrop Saloon. That's a nice name, the Stardrop Saloon. I'd go there. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. You're like 12 and a half and you're working at a bar? That's illegal, guys. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. That's, that's where we are, dude. <laughs> you're not only 12 and a half, but you're a little bit ditzy, aren't you? What's this way? Ooh, is this where you take the hookers? Oh, can I get a call girl? Oh my god. Oh, okay. Is this where you play friendly games of chess with ladies of the night? I can see that happening. What about this? You're not good enough friends with guests to enter his bedroom. Well, didn't want to go there anyway. Oh, it's nine o'clock. Okay. We should probably go to bed. Or we could go work the garden some more because, you know, darkness is the perfect area to the perfect time period to work the garden Ooh, it got creepily empty like doesn't feel so sunny anymore huh, i want to go home please don't mug me i'm just a poor little farmer oh gosh i'm just a poor little farmer don't mind me i don't want to get mugged home again why don't we chop down some trees? Cause you know, what else are we gonna do with our life? Chop, chop, chop. Okay, this is lovely. I love chopping down trees. Why does it keep getting darker? Freaking me out a little bit, guys. I guess that's the game telling me I should probably like go inside, but I don't, I don't wanna go inside. Okay, I get it, game. It's dark outside. I understand. Okay, well, we might as well go inside. No, I want to go go in go inside. Go inside. There we go. Let's go to bed. It's past our bedtime. Go to sleep for the night? Yes. Oh, we made 107 gold. That's lovely. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to leave this video here. You know, if you liked it, favorite, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, you know, share. It really helps. Everything really helps out. And thank you so much for watching. And this is Sergeant Space.